everybody on YouTube today we just gonna get into some simple shit I'm gonna go to work right now about to head to the shop maybe I'll film some stuff in there but only thing about filming in the shop is is that there's just like really poor lighting like the lighting that we have in the shop is like it the camera makes it look so bad it's not actually like that in person the camera just doesn't do it justice at all Dan will be there today so y'all see him but the main event of today is the thrift store so we're gonna hit a couple thrifts I uh, recently moved out here um, closer to Cedar Park if you're uh, aware of like the Austin locations and stuff like that I'm uh, pretty close to like Lake Lime Mall um, so there's a pretty good amount of thrifts out here that I like to that I like to go to so we're gonna hit those right after I get out of work uh, probably about like around seven or so but for y'all it's gonna be around I don't know a minute from now but that's pretty much what we're gonna get into today so you know what I'm saying just stay tuned you know yeah. all right so just arrived at the shop if y'all haven't seen the shop um, I'll show y'all a quick glance right now this is pretty much the outside got our sign Taz pinky in the brand hey Arnold Chucky and we got Rand I don't remember this dude's name, something caveman. And then we got me and Dan right there. It's gonna be a pretty typical day today. Saturday should be a little bit busy. Probably not gonna have enough time to really film and stuff like that. But I'll try my best to get you a quick glance of what goes on today. Uh, me and Dan are just gonna basically, you know, open up, let people walk in, do their shopping, probably do a couple buyouts. Uh, maybe if I get a chance to film a couple buyouts, cause I mean, usually we cash out uh, anywhere between Friday and Tuesday. Um, I mean, we cash out pretty much all the time, but Friday and Tuesday is pretty much the best time to catch us. Uh, we're up on, you know, we're up on uh, sales at that time, so that's pretty much the best time you can catch us at. So, yeah, let's get the day started, you know? We got some uh, some new teas yesterday, some uh, Black History Month, Coca-Cola from 1992, Marilyn Manson tea. I know we had at least one more. Whatever, I can't find it. This is pretty much like our Supreme right here. Again, sorry if the quality is so low right now. The lighting is really poor in here. Um, this is some of our Supreme. Um, Supreme sells really well here in Austin for us. Um, so it's a good thing to keep around, keep on the shelves. These are our jerseys. Um, champion jerseys do really well, so we try to keep our basketball jerseys on deck. Got some Wizards action, got some uh, Grant Hill action. David Robinson, shouts out my boy David Robinson, man. See, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a little patch embroidered in there. All leather right here. I know the camera ain't really doing it justice. If y'all need help with stuff like that, red tags are always what to pick up if you're looking for uh, quality vintage Nike. Um, got some Logo 7 Chicago Bulls. Um, 24 bucks. I mean, uh, jerseys do really well. Some stores here in Austin tend to sell their jerseys for about 80 to a hundred dollars. Um, it's not worth it, um, to be honest. I mean, the most I'd ever pay for a jersey is about 40 bucks. So I try to keep mine at a reasonable price that I would pay for it because I know nobody's out there paying 80 to 100. And if you are, shop with me. I got the steals and the deals. Uh, we got some shoes on the wall. A couple new things since y'all been gone. Got some Space Jam 9s, All Star 1s. Aquas. I don't know the name of these. I honestly didn't even know these had dropped until somebody brought them in here. We bought them off of them uh, for a pretty good price. I have them at 200, so it's pretty much like five below retail after tax, of course. Got some Sequoia 8s, some Space Jam 11s, some Sump Tempos, some little stuff that we just like to keep on the wall just in case somebody's looking for it. You know, we got like some Air Max 95, some Bait Collab Sacconis, uh, uh, Nice Kicks 2.0s, uh, airs, Plats, uh, Tempos, Concepts collab, Hirachis, Air Maxes, you know, Victor Cruises. We like to keep stuff like that on the wall just in case somebody is looking for it. Um, sorry for moving the camera so much. I know the, God, I just hate the way the quality is in here. To the man himself. Man himself. What's up, Lozo? Walk him only down. <laughs> So if you already do follow the Instagram, you know that we post probably like four or five times a day. You just find a nice spot, take a picture, post it. Get it wall. sold, get it sold. All right, so we got a few new items. I didn't get to film the cash out. So we got this Lakers, Los Angeles Lakers, Shaquille O'Neal reversible. OG number number 34. We got a Michael Jordan Chicago Bulls with the four or five. Grant Hill for the Pistons, pretty dope. All champion. Got the Mavs, got my boy Jason, Penny Hardaway, pretty dope. 
Orlando. That's actually a kid size. It's a 36. Oh, we also it's got like a youth size. Yeah, you got a little. He actually threw this in for free. This game was his Miami Dolphins. Threw it in for free. Miami Dolphins little pullover. Huge puppy jacket. Right. Pretty dope. He also uh, threw in a Gucci tee, but as soon as we got it, we had it on the glass table, and some dude came in, and he, he copped it off of us. So that was a nice little flip for us. Also picked up a little Scarface shower tee. We keep the Supreme on keep deck. Keep the Supreme on deck, man. All right, so just closed up shop. Me and Dan's going to head to the house. He's actually not with me today, so going to head home. But on the way home, like I said before, I'm going to stop at some thrift. Again, sorry if the lighting's, like, really bad. It's really it's getting kind of dark. I need to get, like, a light or some shit to carry around with me. So we're just going to head to the thrift stores right now, so I guess I'll just see y'all there. Mm -hmm. trenches man at savers by lake line mall um just checking out the sneakers and whatnot seeing what they got so first they got these lebron tens in that crimson orange colorway i forgot the name of these um pretty dope still pretty icy good find they also got some some more lebron nines pretty good condition and then of course you already know you got the special edition Marvel slip-ons for the real player pimps. And the button down section got a nice little Dell Earnhardt with the three-tone colors. NASCAR fully embroidered on the sleeve. Nice little subtle flex piece looking real dingy. Good wrench service plus. Pretty nice find. Seven bucks. Go ahead and leave it though. It's not a vintage piece but you got Coyote ripping through the hat by Six Flags five bucks they're kind of standing on it i'm gonna go ahead and leave it but still pretty cool fit of the day you already know the deal got the tupac on the chest atlanta braves starter patch on the side skinny jeans and my a's you already know the deal man not going to lie i thought this was going to be the spot i thought we were gonna make some moves over here okay making a little subtle flex moves right here hold on got the nautica swim trunks just just poking out Right next to him is a little homie, Nautica going down the leg right there. It's pretty nice, pretty nice. Not vintage, but pretty cool. These actually might be. And eh, nah, they look a little bit newer. Got the, like a newer Nautica logo right there on the leg. So. Oh, Savers Lake line was a bus, so I'm actually just gonna dip on out of here. There's a long ass line at the door anyway, so I wasn't gonna check out because I don't feel like waiting in that line. So we just go ahead and hit the Goodwill down the street. Let's get right into it. Now, I usually don't do this. I'm pulling up at Salvation Army. It's not Wednesday, it's not 50% off, but it was on my way to the house, so I decided to just stop on through, see if they got any steals and deals in here, see if we can find some sneakers, some kicks, maybe some uh, jackets. We need some jackets in the shop. So let's just see what they got in here, man. Nothing too spectacular. Got a Sky Gear, a uh, puffy jacket, three-tone. I like the colors on it, like the blue on it. it. Sits real nice on that green. Got something simple, Texas State Adidas jackets. Um, they always do have a lot of Texas Longhorn stuff in here. Um, nice little genuine stuff, collegiate. Um, Texas pullover, fully embroidered. Um... Uh, I'm like that's about it. Well, you know, got some nice little uh, Perry Ellis. Look a little newer though. Still a nice piece. I will say one thing about Salvation Army. Out of all the thrift stores that we shop at, Salvation Army never switches up, man. They keep their prices legit. They're the cheapest thrift store in Austin, in my opinion. Um, we do have places like Thriftland and Thrift Town. Thrift Town's cool. Um, they got good prices as well. Uh, they, we do find a lot of windbreakers there. That's my spot. If I want to, if I think we really need jackets in the store, I'll go out to Thriftland and go out there and shop. But it's supposed to be a secret, so don't tell anybody. But that is one thing about Salvation is that they have the best prices. They won't always have Fire Flame Fuego in the store, but it is a hit or miss. Um, I do like coming here on Wednesdays. 50% off. 50% off. Um, and you can you can find some pretty cool stuff in here so don't really know what this is but I do like the print on it it kind of reminds me of uh, I can't 
can't even think of the cartoon. There used to be a cartoon, basically the title looked like this and the same font and everything. That's pretty dope. Found this little button up piece, pretty cool. All over print button up by, I'm not gonna believe this, Tabasco. Now Tabasco has been putting out a lot of sportswear. I've been seeing it all around the thrifts. Um, this is just, this is sick right here. This is amazing. I really dig this. This is not my size though. XL. Sorry Tabasco, it's a double X around here, boy. All right, so I'm walking out, uh, about to hit the next thrift, and I turn around and I see these in the case. Little bobbleheads by Tops. These are super dope. Unfortunately, my camera is going to die right now. This will be the last thrift store I hit. Uh, I'm sorry that I didn't find any Fire Flame Fuego. Like I said, more videos to come. You know, it's, it's, it's some days you have your good days, you have your bad days, and you have your worst days. Today was just not a good day for me. But we'll bounce back. We'll find some more flame. More shit will come in the shop. I'll show y'all things like that. If y'all did like this video, please give it a thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe. If y'all like the way that I film inside of the store and show y'all what we do in there, please let me know. Leave it in the comments. I'll bring that more to you. Like I said before, if you haven't followed the store already, I'll leave the IG right here. It's Stacks Austin. And also, you can shop with us online. I'll put the link to our online website down below. And I'll also leave it right here. It's StacksAustin.BigCartel.com. So make sure to go check that out. Shop with us. Shop with me. All that. Go check it out. Go check out the IG. But with that being said, that's going to be it for today. Appreciate you guys watching. Scud TV. I'm out. Peace.